Well, hey guys, today, so before we start this video, make sure you vote on the poll I just made that sense if you know already and that I, my simio Sam Raimi, Tobey Maguire, Black House and Spider-Man, it still fits me and you wanna know how weight I lost so much and so on smell but I'm not gonna get into that part but um, yeah it still fits and I'm in great shape wearing that than the into the spider verse Peter B. Parker, but it will still be the same. I just need to keep burning up and always get predictable with issues. So make sure you hit that like and subscribe and please hit that vote. Help me the most vote it got if you want me to wear this suit and for the upcoming anime convention called Fanime. I highly appreciate it. If you want me to wear this then yeah, if there's zero votes, then it's up to me. But yeah, please follow me on Instagram, um, Spider Blondie. I'll le I'll have a link in the description if I can. And please like and subscribe. Like I said, since you don't want to miss out of me dressing as Spider Kirito. So let's get on to the main event. Yeah, I'm trying to be scared since I'm always doing this sideways. But today. We're finally unboxing a kind of bit of rare, but I heard, I don't know, sure I only know it, and I'm going to take up my Spider-Man mask right now, because it's hard for me to talk, since I'm wearing two masks, sorry I'm screwing the camera. But yeah, I finally found this attire, I already opened it, but I'll get to that in a minute. So today we're unboxing the, for the upcoming, coming next month, because my, I'm watching it with my current best friend. Since if you remember, I called him Miles, but I'm not going to call him that anymore since I had to call him a friend. Since his mom already bought tickets for the upcoming Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse. I'm watching it on June 3rd, so I'm watching it after the movie it released. So please guys, since you enjoy watching it on opening day, please guys, no spoilers since I'll make a spoiler when I watch it. So... Bear with me, don't do it, or else there'll be a disaster with YouTube. And so, so let's get on to the video. So yeah, but yeah, of course, Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse Part 1, again, it's not going to be called Part 2, but it says right there because they're going to change the title called Spider-Man Beyond the Spider-Verse. But yeah, today we're opening up the Marvel Legends Retro Spider-Man 2099 figure and I heard this kind of a bit a disappointing figure but I hope I kind of liked it a little because yeah um seeing a lot of people re reviewed it and to see how like it I am in person since if you want to get one feel free since there were six of them at my other target location um and they were like seven spots like like where is he like him but yeah, Spider-Man 2099, Migo O'Hara. And I wish they come with his head. I was kind of so, come on Hasbro, please add more detail. So, but yeah. So yeah, here we have the packaging. So sadly, really not that a huge fan of these cards, but they're decent since I, I already opened it. Since I'm in carefully enough to open it, not damaging the card. But sadly, I kind of did, but you see. So let's hurry up and do it. So we have Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse, 4 Plus, and here we have Miles, Gwen, and 2099 himself, Marvel Legends Studios, um, 2099, his name, Miles the Spider logo, Hasbro, here you have the backs, and here are other figures, I might get Miles, but rather, and I haven't opened the one with the Marvel Legends, so I'll do that for a little when I never get the I forgot what's that called again the st stuntman whatever it's called let me know in the comments 2099 so Jessica Drew spider punk the spot and Peter B Parker and here you have him so so let's get things open so I was messing around trying to open him first because I never how to open it right since I didn't follow Sherman's prime but I kind of did it's just because I don't know I always because I already damaged the card a bit by opening the side I thought it would 
work for me, but it doesn't work. So I went to short them with Prime on YouTube and kind of damaged it. So what I did is just do what Sherman Miss Prime did and cut it with the exacto blade. So we're gonna take them out right here. Dang on, it's kind of hard to do it on camera. I'll do a comparison another day since I'll get ready for the movie soon so I'm not gonna do a comparison today for this right now since happy Martyrs Day guys so let me show you it off there you have it so that's how I take it out like Sean Miss Prime so it's pretty so I'm not sure it's gonna be a rare figure and hard to get but hopefully not many people might not like this, but here you have him. He comes with the cape. I'm not gonna get the basic figure, but hey, I'm gonna old. I better quit chit chatting because I always chit chat in past videos, so I'm getting annoyed by these people. So here you have it. Let's take him out and see how he is. I don't want to break him, but I never break. Marvel Legends before but we'll have to see if I can so yeah I'm not gonna consider this as a review I'm just only showing you the figure and unboxing well unboxing to show hard to do this in one hand I'm sorry guys I'm not gonna bore you too much but Yeah, yeah, he's accessory in him in the box. He comes with two fisted hands. And I believe he says, oh, his hand. So let's take him out. So, yeah, if he is going to be the, the main villain and if he's going to become good in the second movie, nah, I'm not going to talk about that much since it's coming very soon. Oh, yeah, it's plastic. But here you have him. The main character himself, I'm just want to consider him, he's also the main character, but main villain. And hopefully he's not, but he kind of looks like he is. Because it's about being Spider-Man, it's a sacrifice. Here you have it, I'm not sure the camera's going to focus. Yeah, Spider-Man 2099. And if you know guys, he kind of bit changed from the... Spoiler alert guys, but it's been a year already since... He was teasing the post credit scene. He wasn't in the regular site he is, but then now they changed him up a bit. Well, you guys know that already. They want to give characters something different and represent still, but it's kind of decent. So here you have him. Spikes or fins, spider legs, whatever they're called. He looks kind of sick to me in my opinion. I'm not going to lie, but... I know most people criticize, just let me know guys, or maybe I could do another poll list, but please, please guys, vote on anything for my Sam Raimi Bully McGuire suit, no, except I noticed the lens are cracking, but I'm not going to talk about that, we're talking about Spider-Man 2099, so I'm sorry guys, but it looks sick in blue, so I'll do a conversion one day. When I do some clear since I'm too busy with all this stuff. So, hope you guys enjoyed this, guys. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Well, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later. Spider-Man Across the spider race On June 2nd. Don't miss it. See ya.